Rediscovering Conscious Sound Within the energy matrix of all creation, God's source first expresses itself as an eternal field of sound current. Through the Guardian ES material, the sound current is considered to be the Holy Mother Principle, acting as the first cause of creation as sound, in which the living consciousness expression then emerges into density through the emanation of light, which is the Holy Father Principle. Holy Mother and Holy Father as conscious sound and conscious light expanding and contracting the sound fields to become light fields and cycling back the light fields to become sound fields continuously. This dynamic perpetually transmutes the light fields back into sound fields in all of the densities eternally in order to serve as the perpetual motion for the ongoing evolution of the individuated consciousness traveling in the universal time matrix. The unified field of energy is composed of lines of light, which cross over and through each other, creating a variation of geometric forms which serve as a fabric of light or grid structure. This base light grid is the foundation for building multiple layers of more complex instruction sets for light symbol codes and geometric sound codes, which include the platonic solids, which form into the blueprints for consciousness. There are only five formations that provide the base math in the grid, and these are the four-sided tetrahedron, six-sided cube, 8-sided octahedron, 12-sided dodecahedron, and the 20-sided icosahedron. This is the map which gives us the math to the basic elemental structure of Earth's creation principle. The tetrahedron evolves into the interlaced tetrahedron or two tetrahedrons that join together in a star tetrahedron pattern. The sonic geometries, light symbol codes, are based in the platonic solid shapes and lines of light that are programmed from one dimension above where they are being directly placed in the field. This is accomplished by directing geometric codes from mathematical shapes which form into light programs into one dimensional area in order to direct the appropriate sound frequencies into the dimension above it. In directing certain light symbol codes into a specific dimension of time and space, the architect behind the making of the blueprint is simultaneously directing sound wave frequencies or sonic geometries into the dimension that exists above it. Remember that sound makes geometric forms, which become patterns made visible through light. The interplay of light and sound must be used together in the creation of energy fields and forms, and thus the male and female principle are always entwined and working together in some capacity in the mechanics of creation. What is contained in the sound waves that form into more complex geometric patterns also directs the quality of that consciousness energy in frequency resonance in either positive vibration or negative vibration. Every form is a vibration wave which contains geometry which fluctuates and these shapes are vibrational fields containing electromagnetic information or energy signatures. The planetary grid network is made of geometric shapes that contain frequencies coming from both organic sources and artificial sources. Each shape or geometry has its own frequency. Thus these shapes of frequency have influence on our consciousness level, when exposed to certain fields of geometric patterns, 
This impacts our bioneurology at unconscious levels. Currently, we are being assaulted with weaponized versions of these geometries from the transnational corporations, the mainstream media, and big tech, who are controlled by the two main satanic councils running BlackRock and Vanguard. These are shapes with frequency patterns and subliminal information which form into logos, emblems, symbols, and numbers which are produced into the perception of many different commercialized brands that are owned by the few. The same groups of people in the controlling bloodlines that hold an inverted energetic signature that is harmful or running very low frequencies. We have learned that many of these corporate logos are intentionally designed for immersion in the lunar matrix geometry propagation as the black cube, as well as proliferating a range of satanic frequencies. For more on this, see Controller System Inversion in the Ascension Glossary. Thus, we have to be awake and aware of this mind control programming in order to neutralize its negative effects when it is being targeted against our subconscious and conscious mind through media exposures. When our planet was invaded, these non-human forces understood they would gain control over sound waves and sonic geometries in the architecture if they destroyed the mother principle by disfiguring the sound body templates throughout the planetary network and then replacing it with an artificial version. Further, they knew that to enslave a species, they could effectively use the power of sound waves and frequency along with dissonant geometric programs to trigger reversal stimuli that conditioned us to damage our own human DNA potential. Yet we must learn from the sound wave weaponry and the sonic geometric code programs that have been used against us and reclaim the power of sound technologies for the empowerment and upliftment of all humanity. All human beings are exceptionally receptive and inclined to reverberate with resonating sound tones or energy waves, especially those that naturally emanate from the planetary body or our core spirit. When we can utilize sound waves such as harmonious music, words or tones that feel positively resonant in the cells of our body, we automatically increase inner harmony and coherence, which greatly strengthens our spiritual and physical immunity. Curiously, the beauty of the sonic geometries is increasingly present in the extensive fields of plasma flower activations happening in the planetary architecture as a result of the return of the Emerald Order. These naturally sing the frequencies of the Christos Sophia Twinned Heart Song, which emphasizes the amazingly high frequency of flowers wherever they are found, which is inherent within the Holy Mother's sound signature of the Holy Spirit's sonic geometries. The frequency of flowers in their plasma architecture are reorganizing the energy field with high-frequency geometric flower patterns of every shape and essence highlighting the Sophianic power of sonic plasma flower shields that are now returning and healing the planetary grid to circulate chalice points of living light current. To regain our minds and our health, we must regain the knowledge of the immense power behind sound technology and sonic geometries for spiritual healing through the science of 
cymatics, and how this information was actually at the foundation of building the energy circulating architecture of our technologically advanced human society in which poverty and disease was non-existent.